Hey guys, it's Luna. We are back in <clears throat> Invisible Apartment. So, <clears throat> when we left off, she had found the source of where it was coming from. And so, Bunny says, I'm prepared. Then she hears something. She takes a step back from the terminal. She looks around, but doesn't see anyone. Ew. We should try to leave now. Wait. I'm feeling, I feel like I'm being watched. Why so sudden? I do not understand these mood swings. Intuition. Better than software. I have a bad feeling. Let's run. Let's, let's return later. She leaves the room and walks past a man who is about to enter the room and she speeds up. Oh, that was close. That was really close. I mean, who knows what could have happened. Oh, and he's following us. Man. So you're everything but the ordinary. Is there something you don't hack? What? The man grabs Casey and pushes her into the apartment. You're a hacker? So you kick the guy as hard as you can to play dumb. Let's see. Thing is, though, is if we kick him as hard as we can, then it's still going. He's still going to chase after us. Let's just play dumb. Stop for a second as if she splashed, if someone, if someone splashed water in her face. I needed to be sure. Go away! Leave me alone! Not until you tell me what you're doing at the, doing, what you've been doing at the sleeper cells. Leave! Explosive, explosive with detonation in five, four, three, no! Don't blow my head off, <laughs> idiot. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm not afraid to die. Actually, yes, I am. Don't hurt me, please. <laughs> right. Why the one cell? Leave. Let me go, you stupid idiot. I'll kick you if you keep touching me. I don't want to hurt you, okay? I'm a friend. <clears throat> sure. Honey, please. Let me <clears throat> Honey, please let me go. I'll, ki I'll give you a kiss afterwards. Let go. Man, she's trying everything to keep this guy except for actually kicking him. The sleeper cell you were at. What is her name? Alex. Alex, let me go and then go to hell, okay? Right. You don't seem to understand. I won't let you go until you tell me what you were doing at the one cell. Bunny starts crying. I'm a friend, okay? You're a hacker, right? Huh? What? Hacker? Huh, I'm a hacker too. I'm no idiot. Okay, so apparently Alex... I wonder what Alex's connection with the one sleeper cell is. Because apparently he's very determined to find out why we are where we're at. And why we're doing what we're doing. And so on and so forth. So I wonder if, what his connection is to that. But he stops struggling. I'm not here to hurt you. I just want to talk and know what's going on. I just want to know the truth. Why are you trying to get into Central Authority servers so badly? Central Authority? No one is no one is trying to get into their servers. Even if I theoretically would stop. Quiet now. Even if it theoretically was my goal, how could you possibly know about it without working for them? What do you know about this place? What do you know about this apartment? You hacked it. And it's not invisible in the city's da database. It's like a black hole. What are you saying? You think I did this? Don't trust him. Ma so Mask is trying to be like the good alter ego type thing. It's really like, don't trust him. You can't. Don't do it. It's I don't know. Now be quiet for a moment. I didn't do this. I couldn't have. If I knew how to do such a thing, all, then all my problems would have disappeared a long time ago. I have no way of trusting you. What if you're one of the ones to set this place up, huh? Then that might be a honey. Then this might be a honeypot. Did you ever? Did that ever cross your mind? It, bunny, poor bunny. You want to get caught? 
I don't want to get caught. Of course I don't want to go to jail, but I also need some answers. What are the questions? Truth's expensive. Speak. She speaks in a calm voice. I'm tracking a connection. A hacker. The trace of the connection led, led me to the sleeper cell's terminal. I want to follow the track from there. That's all I'm telling you. Alex freezes. Give me the data you have. If it's true, I'll help you. If not, then you should stop what you're doing. If someone is hacking sleeper cell terminals, then the people inside might be in danger. Are you making me your cheap informant? Are you playing detective here? Sleeper cells aren't your business either. Either. Besides, they're filled with dead people. They're not filled with dead people. Alex shouts at Bunny. She freezes. Do not shout at me. Me talking with you is the only is only my decision is only my own decision. Let us keep that in mind. She speaks in a calm voice. Bunny looks away. I'll grab you again if you try to kick me or run away. <laughs> Wishful thinking. What now? I may have found some data, but I don't know whom they belong to. I could perhaps make you a copy if it still exists in the future. Maybe. But I'd appreciate something in return. Maybe something you found too? You changed your hair. Bunny inhales and, inhales and holds her breath. Okay, so he knows that we changed our hair. So, how... Who is he? A few seconds pass until she finishes and process that sentence. Oh, yeah? What color were they before? Pink. Oh, crap. He knows our head. He, he, he knew... He, he knew we cut our hair, color our hair and everything. My head hurts from all the arguing. But I think I... But... I can still think straight. How do you know? I work for the Central Authority. What? Bunny turns pale. You're insane. This is important to me. Give me the data which led you to the sleeper cell. Mask? Yes. What are the chances that he'll use the evidence and we end up in jail? The, the odds are 27 to 1 that this is a trap. Bunny silently looks, at, looks Alex in the eyes. What's your name? Bunny giggles. That's asking too much. Not part of the deal. Call me Bunny. Tomorrow. Tomorrow? Bunny takes a deep breath and runs outside while throwing a memory card at Alex. She runs out onto the street and heads towards the park. In the late evening, she sits at a bench in, the, in a public park hours. For hours, she looks into the distance. At night, she's still there. Hours fly by until it's morning. You know, I'm scared and excited at the same time. I notice that the movement of your fingers. In other words, my hands are shaking. Yes. On one hand, I want to act like an action hero, but on the other hand, I'm scared and I'm Promise you, you, you promised that you would meet you will meet him again. I haven't talked to anyone in ages. Hello? A human. I haven't talked to a human in ages. I, I almost forgot what conversation means. And now someone's telling me that he's on my side. During the time I spent with you, I con I concluded that your fear of being confronted with unconfrontable truths. Contradicting yourself all the time. AI. Logic? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. <laughs> you are far from laughing. In fact, I believe you're almost crying. I am sorry if you disagree with my analysis. On one hand, you want to be a part of these people, but on the other hand, you fear them. <clears throat> okay, so apparently Bunny wants to be part of the society, but yet at the same time, she absolutely so, I am merely reacting to your current stance. I won't run away this time. Don't worry about that. Second encounter. Hello again. Please come with me now. Let me take the man to the rooftop. Why are you taking 
taking risks when you don't do You're still young. You can do anything you please. I haven't heard something that many in a long time. Don't be offensive. I'm just trying to talk with you here. You are making it hard. And you're making it hard. Okay, okay. It's not like I have any choices. I want to live a normal life. Earn a decent living. Be part of society. Have friends again. I swear I'm slowly forgetting how that feels for you. That feels like, why don't you look normal? Some of us just can't. I can't live a normal life unless I live a war for it. Go on. I've been caught between, I, I've been caught when I was a teen for hacking. I was really good though. Or so I thought. Nevertheless, I have a record. A record for hacking disqualifies you, disqualifies you from any decent jobs in this society. That's for sure. <laughs> Most people with records that people don't trust. So, especially if it's whatnot. But, you know, if I think it's our society, if you're caught for hacking, most of the time, the government will give you a choice to either work for us or you go to prison. Your choice. <clears throat> Anyways. But, once I finish school, I realize that the city wants to dissolve me. Kill me. It doesn't want to kill me. Right. Anyway, I don't accept this. I don't accept this. It's flesh I don't accept this. It's flesh And I don't care about anything else than making it invisible. Why do you disappear? The person who made it from the disco from the bottom. The person who made it from the disco from the bottom is a single person who is deep in the air in their infrastructure to help me out. countryside? Should I escape to that? What's the difference then? Oh, alright. Well, I guess, I guess we vegetable growers don't know how to even use a toilet, do we? I came from the outside, from a small town. Sorry. Okay, so... Alex... No, see, I don't want to make millions. No, no, it's not about the money. It's not about the fat at all. The families of old just are essential just They all have only one trait. Their dogmas. So they disqualify you from being, they disqualify you from being life in New Jessica. It's their loss. Life on the streets below her con continues. People are in a 
Celeste is always laughing, arguing, doing everything as usual. Then she remembers. In an instant, she begins to fall, and the sunbeams, sunbeams turn to chilly wind. She, is, she feels frightened. Right before she hits the ground, she opens her eyes and hearts beating fast. This is one of those dreams that you remember vividly. Why are my best dreams the ones in which I die? Maybe you should, maybe you wish to change. Is dreaming of death not symbolic for your desire to escape? You know, this AI is pretty darn smart. I have nothing to escape from, <clears throat> only things to escape to. I have nothing but myself. You are being pessimistic, mystic, though pessimistic again. Let's go shopping. <clears throat> you mean shoplifting. However you call it, the fact is I can't live off air. The man asked you not to do anything stupid for now. Alex, yes, in that dream he reminded me of myself, but when I fell, will he destroy all of my dreams? Is a reminder of reality not a good thing? You're being too philosophic. Let's go. Are you sure? Yes. Let's make use of our time. I'll leave the ears part here just in case. Stay connected and record everything. I don't want anyone sneaking in while we're gone. Okay. Bunny goes to the mall to hack to peel Casey doesn't notice the warning notice the warning messages in her glasses. Men in uniform and in the mall and the mall's entrance closes with a beep. That's when she noticed something's wrong. Uh oh. This is not good. Her heart seemed to jump five beats, but it's too late. She looks at the security agents as they approach her. She's got a confused look on her face. This is it. Such a ridiculous way to get caught as well. I'm better than this. I'm much better than this. I'm too sleek to get caught like this. She's a little, she's 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 a little too confident. I think that's what her issue is. Casey screams for the last time before the guards grab her and take her away. Meet Londo. All right, I think I'm going to leave this right here, <clears throat> and we will continue to get to know Londo in the next episode. So, if you guys like this video, show that like button. Some Slam that subscribe button and I will catch y'all in the next video. Later!